Hey guys, this is BuilderDude35 with a tutorial on how to program the EV3 touch sensor. So here we have out the programming block for the EV3 touch sensor and this is in my opinion the easiest sensor to use because it only ever outputs a value of 1 or 0, true or false, whether or not the sensor is pressed. Uh, f we have two operating modes, we have measure and we have compare, both of which only have state under them and measure all it's going to do is it's going to check whether or not the sensor is pressed if it is pressed it's going to output a true value and if it's not pressed it's going to output false and that comes out through this data wire we also have compare in which you're going to choose one of three states which is released pressed or bumped and it's going to compare uh, whether or not the sensor is in these states so in this case we could say release which is when the presser the sensor starts pressed and then is released and if that happens then it's going to output true uh, and if it's not happening it's going to output false and again we have measured value which is um, the direct state of the sensor just like what we have in measure here uh, it's a true or false value and as I've explained in previous videos the difference between measure and compare in measure it's going to take the current reading of the sensor and output that as a data wire in compare what it's going to instead do is uh, monitor the current state of the sensor and see if it meets the parameters that you set within the block and that outputs true or false so that's the difference between compare and measure and it's it's just a pretty simple sensor to use thanks for watching my tutorial this week if you found it helpful be sure to subscribe for more tutorials like this every week and if you have an idea for a tutorial be sure to submit it in the comments section below thank you and i'll see you next time bye